friends, welcome back to the fourth part of our five part movement series. Um, so today we're gonna begin like we have in the past three sessions. So we're gonna start from standing and we're going to start with our warm up. But before we do that, make sure that you have some space. And if you're dancing with friends, maybe draw your circle around yourself, create your bubble. And if you stretch out, you're gonna have space without hitting anyone, okay? All right, so I'm gonna start the music and I'm gonna have you follow along with me for today's warm up. It's gonna be almost the same as last time. Here we go. So I'm gonna start by taking my deep breath in and let my breath out through my mouth. And again, breathing in through my nose. And breathing out through my mouth. One more time, breathing in through my nose. And out through my mouth. Good. Now we're gonna start on our head today. Get it, wake it up, wake it up, wake it up. Now, what about your neck? And my shoulders? How about your elbows? And your hands? Oh, get those hands. Get them, get them, get them. And how about my hips? Can I get my hips? And my knees? How about my ankles? And my toes? Now can we go back up doing brushes? Brush, 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 all the way up. And my belly. And what about my arms? One arm. And I'll get the other arm. Can I get my head? Good. Now can you stretch out super, super wide? And shrink and get really, really small. And shrink out big and wide. And shrink and get super small. And big and wide. And super small. And big and wide. And shrink, shrink, shrink. And get big and wide. And shrink and get tiny. And a little faster. And out. Good job, go ahead and mount onto the floor and make a sandwich with your feet so that your legs turn into some beautiful butterfly wings. We're gonna start flying our wings today. We're gonna hold that sandwich we made with our feet to help us fly. And maybe me think, what color are your butterfly wings today? I think mine would be rainbow with sparkles. Can you fly really, really fast? Go, go, go! And can you fly really, really slow? And fast, fast, fast! Go, 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 go! And slow. Now go ahead and stretch those feet out in front of you and sit up nice and tall and you can put your hands on your lap. And I'm gonna say goodbye to feet. Hello feet. Goodbye. Point your feet. And flex them and say hello. And point them and say goodbye. And flex them and say hello. Last time, goodbye. Now reach up and touch the sky. And bend and get your toes. And reach up and touch the sky. And bend and get your toes. And shake it out, shake it out, shake it out. And so we go ahead and stand up. All right. So. 
the next thing that we are going to do is we are going to read and dance another story today. So the story that we are going to read today relates to something called balance, okay? So that word balance, maybe you haven't heard of it, maybe you have, but balance means that we're trying really hard to keep our body steady. Or we're trying to keep it from moving. And sometimes that can be really hard to do depending on what shape you're making with your body. So really, um, this book is gonna kind of introduce us to that idea of balance, okay? So go ahead and find a spot where you're going to be able to read and dance today's story with me. So this is called Dance by Bill T. Jones. I am a dancer. I want to dance. So look at the shape he's making with his body. Can we try to make that shape with our body? Let's see if we can do it. Let's see if we can make that shape with our body. So he's on one foot, he has one foot stretched out and he's reaching with the other one. I wonder if I can do it with my other foot. Can I pick my leg up in different ways? And this right here, what we're doing, my friends, with one leg, we're, we have just one leg that we're standing on and the other one is out, this is balancing. Or if I bring it in front of me like this, I'm practicing my balance, or like this, or if I'm standing like this, hmm, what other shapes can we try to balance in? Hmm. Let's see what shape we're gonna try to make next. When I dance, I use parts of me. So in this in these pictures, he's making shapes with his hands and his feet. Can we try to make shapes with our hands and our feet? So first I'm gonna try my hands. Then I'm gonna try my feet. Now I'm gonna try them together. Hmm. What kind of shapes did you just make? I hope they were neat. I bet they were. So not only is the dancer using parts of him, he's also using all of his body, all of him. So that's a really interesting shape. I wonder, my friends, can we make a shape kind of like this? And this also requires that word, that word balance. Hmm. I wonder if we can try to make it. So he is laying on his side and he has his leg up. I wonder if I can put my leg in front of me or up this way. What are some other ways that you can bring your leg up? I can do both. Can you do both? Try. See what you can do. Let's see what shape we're gonna try to make next with our bodies. Before I dance, I warm my body. We do too. And I stretch my body. So do we. I want to dance. So look at these shapes. I wonder if we can try to make them. So maybe you wanna to try to make both of these shapes. Maybe you're only gonna to try to make one of these shapes today. Let's see though. 
So the one shape he's making, he has his leg up and he's grabbing it. Can I do that? Hmm. I'm gonna try this way. I'm gonna try on the ground. I'm also gonna grab my feet from here. Hmm. And then the other shape where he's not grabbing his leg, he's crouched down like this. Can we do that? Let's see. I want to see if I can do that. Hmm. Bending my knees. I can also bend them not so close to the ground. I can bend one at a time. I can pick them up and bend them. Awesome. When I am dancing, I can make lines. So see in this picture, he's making a line with his arm. Hmm. I wonder if we can make lines with our arms. So I can go straight up. I can go up. I can do both at the same time. I can do the other arm. I wonder if I can make lines with my legs. Hmm, let's try. Can we make lines with our legs? Hmm, what about my leg and my arm together? What are some other lines you can make? Awesome. Let's see how we're going to move next, or what shape we're going to make next, I should say. I can make curves. Ooh, look at the curves. I bet we can make curves with our bodies, too. Let's see. Curvy shape. And I can make a curvy shape this way. And I can make a curvy shape this way. And I can make a curvy shape this way. I wonder, I wonder if I can make a curvy shape on the ground. What other curvy shapes can you make? Let's see what shape we're going to try to make next with our bodies. When I am dancing, I can fly high and soar through the air. Oh can we fly high? Can we soar through the air? Can we jump and fly too? Let's see. I'm going to try jumping with two feet and with one foot and the other foot. Both feet. Big jumps. Can you jump? Can you jump on one foot? One foot. Can you do both feet? Can you do two in a row? What about three in a row? One, two, three. Good. But I've got to come down and dance on the ground. What do you think, my friends? Can we dance on the ground too? Let's see. So I'm gonna see if I can dance on the ground. I'm gonna swing my legs and roll. I can roll the other way and draw circles, making sure I'm being safe. can dance on the ground. Good. And that, my friends, is the end of our story. So again, that was called Dance. And I hope that you enjoyed moving and dancing along to that story with me today. So the next thing that we are going to do is we are going to find 
our own spot again. So if you lost your spot, make sure you found it again. You have your area where you're going to be able to move um, because we are going to do a little bit more work with that word we learned about today, that balance word. Okay, so we're gonna practice our balance. So, at this time, my friends, I'm going to invite you to get a bean back to participate in this next activity. So I'm gonna give you a second, and if you don't have a bean bag to use, we can also use scarves for this exercise. But take a second to get your bean bag. Once you've got your bean bag, go ahead and stand up with it. So what we are going to do with these bean bags is we are going to dance along to a song called the Bean Bag Boogie. Okay? So we're going to have to use our listening ears to figure out where we are going to have to balance our bean bag. So maybe it's gonna say our shoulder or our head, maybe a foot, but we're going to have to be using our listening ears, okay? So we're holding our bean bags right now. I'm gonna start the music here and we'll do the bean bag boogie, okay? Feel free to move along. Shake, shake, shake your bean bag. Shake, shake, shake your bean bag. Everybody come on, shake your bean bag. Can you shake, shake your bean bag in a circle? Don't let it drop. Can you shake it low to the ground? Hold the bean bag on your head. Can you put it on your head? Hold the bean bag on your knees. On my knees. Hold the bean bag on your tummy. And bring it around if you please. Oh, way down low. Hold it high in the air, don't you let it High in the air. Now shake and wriggle, cause you're doing the bean bag rock. Shake, shake, shake your bean bag. Shake, shake, shake your bean bag. Everybody come shake your bean bag. Shake your bean bag, don't let it drop. Don't let it drop. Let's all do the bean bag rock. Hold the bean bag on your elbow. On my Hold elbow. The bean bag on your toes. On my Hold toes. Hold the bean bag on your ear. And let me see you wiggle your nose. Wiggle your nose. Hold the bean bag way down low. Hold it way down low. Hold it high in the air. Don't you let it go. High in the air. Now shake and wiggle. What you're doing the bean bag rock. Shake, shake, shake your bean bag. Come shake, on, come shake. on, come on. Shake your bean bag. Shake, 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 shake your bean bag. Stop! It's called the bean bag rock. Good. Awesome. So, before we put our bean bags away, and I hope that you had fun dancing along to the bean bag rock, um, we're going to try to balance our bean bag before we put it away. All right? So, my friends, I'm curious. Can you balance that bean bag on your head? Were you able to do it? Try. And see, can you take a couple steps with it on your head? If you have to hold it with your hand, that's okay. But see if you can take a couple steps. Oh, can you step backwards? Ooh. Now what about my shoulder? Can I put it on my shoulder? Can I take a couple steps with it on my shoulder? If you have to hold it in step, that's okay. Can I walk in a circle? Good. Now my friends, what about my knees? Can I put this bean bag on my knees? Hmm, I'm gonna see. This one's kinda hard to do it like this, but I can pick my knee up and balance and set my bean bag there to balance. 
But if that's tricky for you, try this way. You can kneel down on one knee, put your other knee up and set it there. That's balancing on your knee too, right? So what's another place I could balance my bean bag? Hmm, I'm gonna balance it on my foot. I wanna see if I can pick my foot up with the bean bag on it. Ooh, take a second. Try to balance your bean bag in a couple other places. I'll let you decide. I'm gonna practice a couple others. I can put it on my hand. I'm gonna try one more time on my head and try to walk with it there. What about you? So my friends, go ahead and take a second to put your bean bag away. We will be finished using it for today because we have one last thing we're going to do. So, I have with me again today my maraca and my drum. So, we're going to play a little game, okay? And we are going to practice counting to four. That's what this game is gonna go up to. So when this maraca is playing, we are going to be moving our bodies. So maraca starts with an M and move starts with M. So when we hear the maraca, we're going to get to move safely in our in an area where we won't hurt others. When the maraca stops, we'll freeze our body. And we'll find a shape to make with our body so we can practice right now. So I'm going to find a shape to make with my body. Did you find the shape? Now stay in that shape for a second. One, two, three, four. Now relax, shake it up, shake it up. So when you hear the drum playing, that's what you're going to be doing. You're going to be balancing in your shape, all right? So let's, let's practice. So first we're gonna practice moving. So when you hear this maraca, go ahead and be standing up, have your spot, and I'm drawing a circle around me, and this is my area where I'm going to move. And when I hear this stop, I'll stop. Ready? Finding a shape. Can you make a shape with your body? And can you stay there? One. So I've been in my shape. One. Two. Three. Four. Now I'm going to wait to hear the maraca. When I hear that maraca, I know I can move. shape that you're going to balance in. Go ahead and make that shape with your body. And we're going to stay in that shape. One, two, balancing three, balancing four, and And then 
think about it for a second. What's your next shape that you're going to balance in? Ready? One. Balancing two. Balancing three. Balancing four. And move, 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 move. balancing and I hope that you had a lot of fun practicing your balance today. Before we end though, I'm going to put on some music and safely in our bubble we're going to do a little bit of free dancing. So maybe today in your free dance you're going to make a couple shapes to balance it. Maybe today you're only going to make a shape at the very end of your goodbye dance when we freeze. That'll be up to you but Go ahead and be creative, have fun, and enjoy yourself. Good work today. Here we go. Go ahead and find your spot where you're going to start your free dance. And here we go. Sorry. Here we go. so far. So far I've made a couple shapes with my body. How about you? I'm going to see if I can make a shape with my arm and my leg. I'm going to dance on the floor and find a shape to balance in. Now slowly start to think about what shape you're going to end your creative dance in today. What shape are you going to make? Here we go. Three, two, one. Find your shape. And shake it out, shake it out. Give yourself a pat on the back. Give yourself a pat from the other side. Great job. Great job. Thank you so much for dancing with me today. See you next time. <laughs>